Okay, today is gonna be a quick little video about a feature with Samsung smartphones I didn't know I had, and it's called link sharing. I wanted to transfer a file or send a file to somebody, but it was too large to email, and it's difficult to send it over WhatsApp or text message because the file either becomes very compressed and you lose video quality, the file is a video I'm trying to send, or there are limitations in those apps. For instance, WhatsApp, the largest file you can send is 64 megabytes. The file I'm trying to transfer is 180 megabytes. So nearly three times the size. Now I could edit it and chop it up into pieces and send them individually, but I discovered a cool little feature in my Galaxy phone that I've never actually used before. So you'll see here I have the videos. They are 180 megabytes each. The video I want to send is this one here. So I can select it and select share. And then at the very top, there is a button that says link sharing. You simply just click on that and that's it. You get this link, you send it to who you want, they select that link and it downloads it. It's as simple as that, 180 megabyte file, 300 megabyte file. I believe you can get up to a five gigabyte file sent in a link. And what this does is it uploads the file to the Samsung cloud using this specific link and then you can send that link to someone. Now, there are some cool features about this. For instance, you can auto delete files that they've been when they've been received and sent files. So this will automatically delete this file out of Samsung Cloud, not off your device. Once this file has been received by at least one person that you've shared the link with and you can set to use Wi-Fi only, which is typically pretty smart to do because if you're sending a large file you probably don't want to use your cellular data to do that so we can go back now we can see in link sharing this is the area that the file is in currently on my phone we can copy the link or we can share the link or we can click on the x and this will no longer be able to be downloaded from the link that you share so if you share it with someone once you've received confirmation from them or you have the setting in there to automatically remove the file once it's been received, it will remove it or you can manually remove it. So we can also go to the account at the bottom and see all of the files that have been shared. So I just thought this was a pretty cool, very useful feature to get videos from my phone to my PC or my phone to somebody else that's not in the area. From my phone to my PC, I could just plug it in and copy it. And actually, this is fairly fast downloading from Samsung's site. So let's take a look. We can copy our link and we can see here on the PC. Let's open our web browser. So the website is https link sharing dot samsung cloud dot com and our link ID is let's give that a shot. It would help if we put in the slash there. And there's our file. We can download it, save file, we'll save it to whatever is on our PC. And it's already complete. So the service is very fast. It's not kilobytes per second. It's literally as fast as your internet, but my, I have one gigabit internet. So it's at least as fast as that. This took less than two seconds to download. So I'm impressed with this cool little feature. Now, if we go into our, our app and we select our link, Let's close it. We'll say delete, no longer available. This link should no longer work. If we refresh, the link sharing has been canceled by the sender. And we can see that the, that the videos still exist on our phone. It's still there without any issue. So I hope you find this feature useful. It's definitely useful to me. Even just getting some videos off my phone because the upload and download speeds are so fast which may partly be because i have fairly fast internet for my house 
But even if you're at you know 50 or 100 megabits per second at home, this should be faster than you know. It might even be faster than trying to get to your computer or email it to yourself or plug your phone in and go to your gallery and scroll down, try and find the video that you're looking for on the computer and copy it over. This is legitimately fairly quick. And to take the link sharing even one step further, there is a link sharing app for your PC if you're on Windows. You can install, you can go to your Microsoft Store, search for link sharing, download and install the link sharing app from Samsung Electronics. So we can launch this and we can share files from our PC with a link to our Samsung account. This just gets better. So if we click on the account button here on the left, we can see the files that we've shared from our phone. We can select them and download them directly to our machine. We also are provided with a link. We can copy it, we can paste it, we can set it in a chat over Microsoft Teams, whatever it is we want. We can add files, drag and drop, and we can see center received on this computer. We can share as a link. Got the settings down here with your Samsung account. Mine's gonna be blurred out. This is my personal account. A pretty simple little app, but it makes it easy and worth using on your phone to just have to click on a button to share the link. You open this up on your machine and your file is there once it's been uploaded. It's like Dropbox, but provided by Samsung. So go get the app from Microsoft, click on that link share button. I hope it helps you out. If it does, awesome. Let me know in the comments below if it did. If you knew about this feature, because I didn't. Bye.